Dreams are a way we escape into a world of our own. Why do we dream? Why do we sleep for that matter? Dreaming happens during most of the different sleeping stages. Most commonly, dreaming happens in the REM, rapid eye movement stage of sleep. When we're awake, our brains are working perpetually. Sleeping gives our brains somewhat of a break from all that work. You sleep to get rested and get energy, right? Wrong. Actually, researchers have done multiple studies and found that there is no actual role or function that sleep refreshes. The brain, however, has been proved as a different story than the body. Through tests, it has been concluded that sleeping might actually help your brain in ways such as mastering skills. Skills like learning instruments, riding bikes, and improving and consolidating other information you learn. Sleeping has many different cycles that play a part in dreaming. The five repetitive cycles you have while sleeping include rapid eye movement, REM, non-REM, as well as waking. Patterns of sleeping cycles usually come as waking, four non-REM cycles, and one REM cycle. If you're paying attention, you might notice that I mentioned six cycles. Waking is when your body prepares to go to sleep, depending on who you ask. Waking is sometimes regarded to as a cycle, but sometimes it isn't. After the waking stage, you have four non-REM stages. The funny thing is, before you go into your REM stage, the second and third non-REM stages repeat, and then the REM cycle starts. So it's almost as if you go through six non-REM cycles. REM sleep is more able to be recognized than non-REM sleep because during REM sleep, which includes rapid eye movements, REM sleep also contains more twitching of the limbs and higher heart and breathing rates. Ever had a nightmare after watching a scary movie? That dream occurred during your REM sleeping cycle. Psychiatrist Sigmund Freud suggested that REM sleep was a way for making up for repressed experiences, which occur during our waking hours. Rapid eye movement sleeping is one of the most active stages of sleep. Also, dreams you have during REM sleep are typically more vivid than dreams that occur during other stages of sleep. On rapid eye movement, non-REM sleep, is a more relaxing stage of sleep where dreams aren't as common. When non-REM sleep is recorded, people tend to have slow brain waves and low and regular breathing and heart rates. What you dream during your non-REM sleep is said to be a recreation of some psychologically important event. All the vivid dreams people have and remember are REM dreams. The dreams you have during non-REM are less frequent and aren't remembered as easily. Overall, we are still learning about why we dream. And since scientists are still researching, hopefully our questions on sleeping and dreaming will get answered soon.